I say, peace be with all of you and special peace be with our children who I want to invite for a special message and a little time here together. And I will say good morning to you, my friends. I do want to give you a reminder that I miss you. I miss all of you, and I miss having you right up here next to me on the stairs. I especially miss having you up here today because it's one of those days when I would love to hear your answers to a question that I want to ask. And here's that question. Do you like to climb trees? Now, if you were here, I bet some of you would say, yes, we love to climb trees. Our two sons, Samuel and Benjamin, love to climb the trees in our yard. In fact, Ben was out yesterday climbing the trees, and you see a picture of him there on your screen. He didn't get up there all by himself, but he did spend a lot of time up there. We also like to go up in the trees when we are in the woods and hiking our friend Gabe even has a tree house in his yard. I wonder if any of you have a tree house in your yard. It's almost time to start going back out to our tree houses. Well, today's Bible story is about a man named Zacchaeus, and my guess is that some of you have heard about this man and about his story. We love this story because Zacchaeus climbed a tree. Now, he didn't do it for fun, and he didn't build a tree house up there, but, but he did climb up the tree, and he did it so that he could see Jesus. Remember that often Jesus would have large crowds of people following him wherever he went, and that was certainly true when Jesus came to Jericho, the town where Zacchaeus lived. And Zacchaeus, who was not very tall, really wanted to see Jesus. So, he climbed a tree to see Jesus. But it's what happens next in the story that is most amazing to me. Yes, Zacchaeus climbed the tree so that he could see Jesus, but guess what? Jesus saw Zacchaeus. He looked up and saw a man in a tree. Then Jesus spoke some kind words to Zacchaeus, and he even went to his house. Here's what that means to me today, that it's really good for us to look, Je to look for Jesus, and, and we don't have to climb a tree to do that. We can pray, we can read the Bible stories, we can worship God, we can look for ways to be like Jesus. That's really good, but it's also good for us to remember that Jesus is always looking for us, too looking for us with kindness and love, with courage. What an amazing gift that Jesus can even find us when we're up a tree. Let's say a prayer to God to thank God for that. And we'll start with our prayer clap on three. One, two, three. Dear God, thank you for finding us with your love. Thank you for showing us the way to love. Help us trust you. Help us love others. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen.